Hello friends, I am Zishan Anwar and in this video tutorial I will show you how AAP works. As you know, AAP is used to resolve the MAC address if the IP address is known of the target device. In this scenario you can see a switch is connected with the three PCs, PC4, PC, uh, you may say PC1 and PC2 and I already assigned the IP addresses on all these PCs. PC4 has IP address 192.168.1.1 and PC1 is 192.168 and 1.2 and PC2 is a, has a 192.168.1.3 a now since the IP address has been assigned but it has never communicated before so whenever this PC if this PC wants to talk with this PC it means PC4 wants to talk with PC2 so it needs source MAC address so source MAC address I'm sorry source MAC address source IP address and the target IP address and target MAC address since this PC itself knows the MAC address and source IP address but this PC does not this PC does not know the what is the MAC address of this PC PC2 and what is the IP address of the PC2 every record is maintained in the local connection table or it is something called ARP table so whenever we uh, generate any type of type any type of packet such like ICMP this PC go to first local connection table and check the correspondence MAC address of the IP address so let's check it out if I want to ping this PC that's IP address is 192.168.1.3 if it has the MAC address of this PC of this IP address then this will generate a ICMP packet and forward if this PC has not IP address and MAC address of that PC it means it will generate an ARP packet first and then forward the ICMP let's check out that if it has uh, if it has the target MAC address or not so my target address is now 192.168.1.3 ARP A in the command prompt ARP space minus A in the command prompt and just enter. So we can see the internet address, no address is mentioned, physical address, no answer, no address is mentioned, and the type, not any type, is mentioned. It means this computer has not communicated. So let's just, let's just start. And before starting, I want to say this. Go to the simulation mode so that we can see each and every packet that is generated and that is forwarded so now generate an ICMP packet for the for the 192.168.1.3 go to your pr pr command prompt and just type ping 192.168.1.3 and hit enter as we hit enter we can see there is a two type of packet is generated the one is ICMP that is buffering and the second is ARP that is address resolution protocol since this PC has not any since this PC has not MAC address of the 192.168.1.3 so it generates an IP it generates an ARP packet so that he can resolve the MAC address of the target PC so now let's uh, see actually what is in the ARP packet so double click here you can see that is the outbound PDU details and here ARP process construct a request for a target IP address a device encapsulates the PDU in the Ethernet frame this is the Ethernet frame where the destination MAC address is all bit is on every bit is on because it is a broadcast message and it is the ARP packet where you can say the source MAC address is triple zero ca 73 and the source IP address is 192.168.1.1 and the target MAC address is since the MAC address is unknown to uh, for the PC1 for the PC4 for the source MAC address 192.168.1.1 so target MAC address is unknown so the target MAC address is filled with zero all bit off and this frame is sent to all the connected device it means destination MAC address all bit on so now capture and forward forward switch receives this frame 
only art frame icmp is uh, is not forwarded so far because this pc has not received the mac address of the target pc so icmp is not forwarded and the arp is forwarded once the arp once through the arp mac address is obtained the icmp packet will be forwarded then captured since it is since it since the arp is a broadcast message so each and every connected link except the receiving link except the receiving port switch will forward this arp uh, packet each and every port except the receiving port so now capture and forward so switch forward this arp packet to pc1 and pc2 but pc1 rejected why rejected Let, let's check it out fast ethernet receives the frame the arp request target ip address does not match the receiving port's ip address the arp process drops the frame so this guy wants to know the mac address of the target 192.168.1.3 not for the 192.168.1.2 so 192.168.1.2 drops this frame drops this packet because this is not for him but he receives receives and now we can check it this is the receiving arp where target mac address is 0.0.0.0 every bit is off and this is the forwarding arp where target mac address is something so as this pc receives this frame receives this packet actually it read it out who send it to uh, so send it uh, by Uh, 0002176C CA73 and who, for the, for whom yeah for me so what does he do? did so this guy just mention maintain the local connection table let's check it out now process now my key A is not working here unfortunately Okay, internet address one ninety two one sixty eight one dot one, and the physical address is, is the MAC address is zero 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 two. That is the source of this IP address of this computer actually. So now it has to reply. Okay, actually I have the MAC address something something something. So e this computer reply back to this computer that hey buddy you want to talk to me? So this is my MAC address. So. At the outbound PDU details, we can say now he is reply the ARP ARP. So we can say source MAC address zero 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 six zero. This guy source MAC MAC address. And the target is now this one zero 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 two one seven six C C A seven three. it is not broadcast address it is a unicast why because in this local connection table this ip address and the mac address is resolved and it is maintained so capture and forward and again forward so it receives it maintain the local connection table check it out oh i can't ap can see internet address 192.168.1.3 and the physical address is obtained so now it is time to forward the icmp packet now icmp packet is go 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 and go oh god what the hell anyway Again, ping, ping one ninety two dot one sixty eight dot one dot three. Packet is generated. Forward, forward, forward. Right, it is working. It works. So this is reply from the one ninety two one sixty eight one dot three. I hope you have got the concept behind the app. So don't forget to subscribe my channel for the latest update. Thank you very much.